This week's question is about Kallax shells. Hi there! Welcome to a new Q&A Tuesday video. Um, welcome to the She We Do studio. My name is Irene and every week I answer a question on Tuesdays. So the Q&A Tuesday. If you have a question about the studio, about entrepreneurship, about quilting, just pop them in in the comments below and I would love to make a video about it. So don't hesitate, just put your questions down below uh, and maybe I'll answer your question next week. Um, today I'm sitting in front of my Kallax shelf um, that is supporting my workstation because I got a question uh, about the Kallax shelving and how I liked it as the base for my workstation, if it was high or low enough. So let's do some measuring. I have a measuring tape and the Kallax shelves, I don't have anything underneath. So those are just on the floor. And then we did make it a little bit higher. So um, the Kallax shelf itself is 67 centimeters, which is 30 inches. So until here is 30 inches. And then I added six and a half inches on top to the top level of my workstation, which is uh, 16 centimeters. So go total height of my workstation is 92 centimeters. And that is a little bit over 36 inches. So um, that is the height. So for me, only the Kallax shelves with a um, work surface was too low. So what we did was um, measure what my preferred standing height was. Um, and how you could do that is go to your kitchen counter and see how it feels. We'll first determine if you want to sit at your workstation or if you want to stand. Um, I like to uh, have it high enough so we can stand there because we fold a lot of fabrics and I do a lot of my working standing. And um, well, if you want to have it uh, as a sit down table, just sit behind uh, your um, desk or anything like that, which uh, the height that you like. And then try it out and also put your sewing machine on top of there and see if you like that height. So then you can measure, just measure uh, if you like a height of a special working surface in your home, just measure it and then see if you need to add some height to this. And if you like a standing surface, go to your kitchen counter and stand behind that and see if that's a comfortable height or is it, if it's too low or if you would like it higher, then uh, then you can get an estimate of the height that you need for your workstation. And what we did over here, so this is the workstation that we built. And what we did is make a built-in area for my sewing, um, sewing machine. So my sewing machine won't be added up to the height because then it would get pretty high. Um, but we made it uh, at the same height as the surface of the table. Um, let me insert my machine and then you can see it. There we have it. So this goes in here. And then of course I need to plug it in. And I use my quilting table to finish it off. Um, and what I have then is, um, because this is too low for standing uh, and sewing, so I have the adjustable stool, which is also from Ikea, I love it. And that, um, yeah, lets me kind of sit, stand, behind my machine and it feels really nice, kind of active because most of the times when I'm sewing, I'm getting up a lot to go and cut something or press something. 
So yeah, it's very convenient because you're halfway sitting, standing. For me, this works very well. So there you have it. Do I like the height of the Kallax shelves? Uh, yes, as building blocks, but I did need to add some height to make it a standing um, height work surface. Hope that answers your question and hope to see you again next week. Bye!